269. <laughs> Can't stop my eyes from doing it. They jerk down to the bottom to see if uh, how many units lost. Units lost three is a pretty good sign, probably. All right, finished a wonder. We have a defense event from our city that's being overrun by barbarians being attacked. Military points or orders there. Six orders, so turn isn't terrible. What's the other pop up? For legitimacy for building a wonder. Cool. Okay. Three units. What do we lose? Spearman, Slinger, Chariot. We knew the Chariot was going to die. The Slinger was very likely going to die. We got the Onager for us. And only one Spearman. That seems really gentle. Comparatively. Alright. Looks like we finished the Decree this turn. Let's throw out another one. The city finished a stronghold. We certainly don't want a Byream. Let's grab a Hestastus. Seven is a long ass fucking time. I'm gonna repair this city. If I have action that really like clean these barbs up. Can we kill any? Maybe with the militia. We can actually kill with just these two. That'd be pretty solid if we could take two actions to kill with those two. All right, what do we wanna do up here? So our rush chariots here, which is really important. We did get what we wanted here, which is we have some light chariots that have left the safety of his axemen for the dangerous terrain that is my city. So, the question is, can I get both of them? I mean, it's pretty clear how we attack these. We attack these in a ring of two spears and a chariot are almost always going to kill a flatland unit like that. Yeah, for sure. But I don't have three tiles to attack this one unless I kill this particular axe. I'm not sure I can get that axe. That axe would be difficult to attack. We would have to spear, spear there, chariot, kill that, big unit, move in there, unit plus chariot, kill that, and then spear, spear, chariot, kill this third one. And I don't, we have no range support because our, our only range unit died. So I'm not sure we can do that. We might be stuck on just getting one of these light chariots, and I really don't want to just get one. I wonder if there's any way I can finesse that to working. I mean, we spent a lot of resources the last couple turns setting up those kills on the Onager and the... They've been tight turns. I'm not sure we're going to have the resources available this turn to get another tight turn worth of kills. I don't know how the targeting priority on the Slinger works. I have no clue. If it's going to attack me sometimes, or him, or his city only, or what the deal is. It's his rebel. Okay, so our reinforcements are Chariot, Spear, Spear right now. And those are the only things in range this turn. So where can they reach? Oh, there's another guy just sitting there. Do I ever just go on a killing spree in his back line here? I'm really surprised both my Hestasis are still alive. Must have been too much work to kill him. Like too many actions to kill them. So we have three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, maybe 11 if we're lucky. Something like 11 attacks here.
and it's really three per unit. Yeah, we're probably only gonna kill two units here. And it's probably gonna end up being an ax in one of these chariots. I'd really like to have gotten a second chariot. Maybe I can kill two axes in a chariot. Since this hits that, that hits that. How much more damage do we need on that thing? We don't need a second hit there would be pretty solid. We can definitely kill it with the two Hastasis if we want. Do I have enough for the axe then? I need three and a half. Two and a half. Two. Two and a half. Two. And if I commit the chariot to this tile up here, I don't want to just lose a chariot this turn. I will. The chariot's going to die. There's no way it won't die. I really like to get two of those light chariots. Big limiting factors are the movement range on these spears. So I can do two damage there. Two, four, seven and a half. It's at seven. So the two spears plus this elite warlord will kill that. Got to find the tiles for them, but they're there. So have to move this unit out of the way. This unit could move over perhaps and attack into that, which would be fine, or that tile, one or the other, something like that. I think this unit. All right, does cleaning this unit out help me very much? Not particularly, but it's a kill with units I'm not gonna be able to use otherwise. So that'd be one, two, three of our actions. So then we're gonna have three, four, five attackers left in this area. This unit's not particularly great versus those horses. This unit's horse baned though. Um, hits him for exactly the same amount of damage. <laughs> oh no. Okay. These two can clean up an axe though. That would leave me three spears in the chariot. We could decline to commit the chariot this turn. If Warlord, Spear, Spear kills Axe, Hestastus, Hestastus kills Axe, and Spear, Spear, Spear kills Chariot, I get three kills. Haven't exposed my chariot, so I have it for next turn. It's pretty tempting, actually. I guess then the question is, well, if we do expose the chariot, we can we get, instead of killing axe, axe, chariot, can we kill axe, 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 chariot? Chariot does two and a half. So a single attack there sets that guy up to die. To that. Will have been here. And this unit walks in and hits that guy for four and a half. Chariot's on that tile. Chariot does two and a half. We've hit him for four and a half. So that's seven. So we need two and a half more damage. Can any of my axes hit for two and a half? Yeah, that one hits for two and a half. So then the 
Chariot's there. These are both dead. But that tile is now occupied. And we haven't done any damage to this axe. So it does not... Well, is then their advantage? It can't go down. It's the city center. It can't go left. There's no benefit from doing that. I kill the same number, but I expose the chariot. It's more efficient. I got tons of other guys left to work with. I've lost all my tiles, right? And I won't kill any light chariots doing that. One of the terrain to do it in. Is there a way to get a fourth unit kill this turn? Maybe. How many chariots or how many units does it take to kill that? I mean, I could also chariot, 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 possibly for four. Hitting that thing for four and a half. I think the spear was another three, another four, so it's eight and a half. It's not enough. It takes three attacks to kill that slinger. I don't really give a fuck about that slinger. I kind of like it harassing his units. He building by the way he's still settler so he's still expanding behind this can't decide if that's good or bad honestly cleaning up some axes not committing the chariot Killing two axes and a light chariot actually seems pretty good to me. If I can't get a fourth, I can't figure out where the fourth would be. To get the fourth, I need them all basically connected via the chariot. And this connection fails. Maybe I started the chariot, 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 attack, kill that, go there. Then I have two, but I don't think I can kill that with two. This problem, the, act, the big problem is this axe right here on the center, the center one that I've selected here. I can't get enough tiles to kill it with melee. And it is a linchpin. If I can get its tile, I can kill the other light chariot or continue scything through this shit, but I can't. So I don't, I don't think I can get there this turn. It's too bad. It's close though. All right. So what is it then? It was move, hit, two and a half is a spear attack it was two we're gonna be attacking from our territory though there's still two it's two two and a half with the hill bonus I so don't understand zone control in this game. I'm not sure why I can move into that tile. I feel like this unit should be zone of control locked, but I must be wrong. That unit's gonna have died, so we're talking about attacking that unit. Is there a point in attacking that unit? No, probably the other easy one to kill is the flatland. Or if we move there and attack, it leaves four open. How do we do four damage? This guy then can move to that tile and hit for two and a half. It's not enough. Lost track of where that third unit I was getting was. Just 
So I like that for four and a half. Second one there, third one there. That gets the chariot if we want it. These two get axe. Where's my third fucking unit kill? Oh no, I lost it. Where was it? Get that tile, right? That opens up when I kill this unit. We don't have people who can two-shot that, right? Yeah, we do. If we can get that unit in there, we could two-shot it. So can I kill this unit without using either of the Histostas? Presumably, yes. Two and a half, three and a half, two and a half, does it? Three and a half, two and a half is or two. Things at seven. So three and a half and two is five and a half, and this one hits for two. Okay, so that's how we do that. All right, so here, hit there, hit. This unit goes to there or here. There. Then we bring this guy in, kill. Let me bring you to here. You to here. Hit there. Kill there. Let me bring. I need two spears to attack that. This is spear one. Holds the general. 48, how old is this general? 21, that's where the experience is going. So we go here, hit. This tile is not quite there. Eh, it could be. We want the hill or the flat tile. Okay, there's our three kills. Didn't commit the chariot, didn't get a fourth kill, which is kind of a bummer, but Okay, start there. I wonder if these two should have been reversed. This guy's got the hill bonuses off. Anyway, okay. So those are three kills. We got quite a bit of orders still to work with, which is nice. A lot of things I want to have happening. I have a lot of work. Oh, we should take our kill over here while I'm thinking of it. All right, we need lumber mills, quarries, and the rest of it. So this is kind of annoying, build the Acropolis. We, we have the ability to do it, except for the fact that I think it has to finish in that time, not just start. So instead of having 20 years, we've got like six years. Dude, it's 15 years. We don't even, we have two years? Why is this so long? Can almost afford it this turn. I 
So we want to not, I mean, probably can't afford this turn. I want to hit that legitimacy. It's a good one too to have. So I think we're building it. Question is, can I afford it? I think we can. What's the pop up? Oh, orders or military points. Get all of our workers going. Only problem with getting all of our workers going is they are consistent sources of um, draining. Like I'll have less orders next turn by using them because it's the, it's the upkeep thing. Not upkeep, it's the action they're doing is over time and it's per turn that it drains you. Like I need quarries in here. But down is a hill too, or the Acropolis rather. Strong one for us though. I don't have 300 civics, 300 civics. I'm pretty sure if you finish it the same turn that uh, the ambition ends, you do not get it. I think I've tested that. So I want, I will have 300 next turn. So it has to happen next turn if we want it. Okay. I like the idea of setting up for, but not necessarily committing both these workers this turn. So I like starting a lumber mill there. And there. I don't mind sneaking the chariot closer. Chariot's in range to attack what I need here and it's a cleaving unit, so it doesn't have to be exposed either. Better be reminded of this. Uh, it's a hill, is it another hill wonder? Yeah. Myself know where it's gonna be. Wouldn't mind the lumber mill there. And here. There's no camp on that yet. It's a lot of chopping to be done here. Okay. Uh barbs, 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 seven actions. Do I wish to spend orders this turn? Could repair that. Don't really want to spend stone this turn. Get another mine going in there. I think we go there. Closer for this stuff. Anything we can do in here? This unit could road or fort or both or heal. Where are my roads in the city? Like that. If I don't see a serious amount of reinforcements from him soon, I think that attack might be over. We'll see. I don't have any reinforcements for next turn. So losses here are pretty rough. But it's not super easy for him to get value kills here. I've got pretty good density of unit in there now. So we'll see. That's also a river. Oh, it's outside my border zone. I want the lumber mill started there. Need quarries. Quarries are iron, which is okay to spend right now. Do we want 
this order boost. We probably want the order boost over the military boost right now. Let's go there, but not start anything. Quarry there would be great. I don't know if I can get there. Can. I don't want to build item, items that take stone this turn. Could quarry in here. Kind of want that worker at the front to do something useful. Could just heal, honestly. What's the unit on top of it? We put the camp online too. I need quarry. I need a uh, lumber mills rather is all. That's what this guy's gonna be doing, right? Is quarries. Could also get into my borders to auto heal, which would kind of be nice. All right, let's send that back. Interesting turn. I don't know if this will turn around or not. Depends how many reinforcements he gets this turn. We got three unit kills. Don't feel like we're super exposed there. I'm really surprised the Hastasis are still alive. Our commander Hastasis is fucking deleting things. It's great, 7.2 strength over here. All right, let's send it back. Long turn.